if you love pots overflowing with flowers, gardening editor Doug Oster says try planting with veggies and herbs too. And today we are in the garden with Doug to see how he does it so we could try it too. Welcome back to the garden. Today we're talking all about planting containers and we're going to use our thriller filler and spiller formula to, to plant a really pretty pot. The thriller is in the center. It's the tall plant that is the superstar of the container. For the thriller, I'm going to use this canna. When we're to the end of the season, it's going to be four feet tall and it will be a thriller. And so that goes in the middle. You know, I get a lot of questions about these big containers, whether I sub out all the soil and no, I don't on something this size. I'm only filling up about a third of the top with something fresh. And then during the season, I'll fertilize once a week as I'm watering them. And so in the center goes our thriller. And then for a filler, I went with this begonia. And again, you can look in the nursery to see the plants that you love. The only thing that we're doing here is we're using plants that all kind of like the same sun exposure. So this is part sun, which is these begonias and the canna. And then eventually we're going to put in a euphorbia as our spiller. And it might look small now, but I'm telling you what, in about a month, that is going to be awesome. The next is something called euphorbia, which is the spiller. The spiller just kind of softens the edges. There we go. And I'm also, besides thinking about the sun, I'm thinking about the color combinations. I know the can is going to be red. These are kind of a dark foliage with a pinkish flower, pinkish yellow, and then the white euphorbia. And if you look closely, I always leave about an inch at the top so that when I water, not going to overfill the container. And we always do water before we move on to our next job. Don't wait until the end of the day to do your watering. In the vegetable garden, we can plant just about anything in a pot that we would plant in the actual soil. It's just choosing the right size container for the right plant. And we're going to use the same formula that we did out in the flower garden. Thriller, filler, spiller, and our thriller is a brand new basil called Everleaf Emerald Towers. And I'm so excited about it because I've been hearing about it since last year. A friend of mine grew this, trialed it against like 10 other basils blind with a bunch of people and uh, pairing it with uh, heirloom tomatoes. And this one won hands down, unanimous. So it grows very tall towers. And what I love about seeing plants like this is I've got like five of them in here. I got these at Han Nursery, and that's one of the reasons to go to a good nursery. And I'm going to split these out of here, put them in a little water. And the center plant is going to go as our thriller, and these are going to go somewhere else in the garden. All right, that's exciting. That's a deal right there. So there's our thriller right there. Around it, I'm putting a pepper called Super Chili, and it is my favorite hot pepper 1988 All-America Selection. And if you ever have trouble growing peppers, this thing will put on really spicy hot peppers under any conditions. I've grown it almost in shade and it has put peppers on. And again, this will be our filler because this is gonna be up there. Then you'll have your super chilies around there. And then on the edges, we're gonna use a vine crop and it's a unique cucumber called Brown Russian. And Cucumbers hate to be transplanted. So you'll see them sometimes in flats in the nursery, but I like to start them from seed, put them in a peat pot, get them going. And you can see how these peat pots are just falling apart. And we'll just tuck them right into the soil here. And that will just fade away. It is planting season, and don't think just because you miss getting your garden in on Memorial Day weekend that it's too late. I'll be planting all summer long. You should too. Back to you in the studio.